Hi, I'm Steve at the Carmichael Workshop. Today I'm going to make a display rack for my Hard Rock Cafe pint glass collection. Back in the early 2000s, I used to travel sometimes for work. And if I would visit a city that had a Hard Rock Cafe, I would go check it out and pick up a pint glass that had the city name on it. I'm up to 16 of these glasses so far, so I want to make this display rack hold a little bit more than that in case I pick up some more glasses on my travels. So I'm going to do three shelves that will hold seven glasses each for a total of 21. I'm going to use my X-Carve CNC machine provided by Inventables, the sponsor of this video, to make this project. I use their free easel design software to design this display rack so that it could be cut from two 1x12 pine boards that are 29 inches long. If you're interested in shopping for an X-Carve or trying out their free easel software, I'll put a referral link in the video description below. Let's go take a look at my design. In easel, I entered the dimensions of my boards, which are 11 and a quarter by 29 and 3 quarter inch thick. I also entered that I'm going to be using an eighth inch straight bit for this project. I measured a pint glass and drew a rectangle with evenly spaced circles to hold seven glasses per shelf. The circles will be recessed so the glasses can't slide around. I drew a side piece with three rectangles for dados to accept the three shelves, and I added holes for attaching them with screws. The top of the rack is basically a sign that can be personalized just by changing the text. I added a hole to the top of each side piece so it could be attached as well. At the bottom of the screen, I added a workpiece for the second board. I added two copies of the shelf, and I also added a copy of the side piece which needed to be flipped so it's a mirror image of the other side. I'll put a link to open this easel project in the video description below in case you want to make one with a CNC or just use the template to make one with other tools. Now let's head over to the X-Carve and cut it out. Since I'm not in any hurry in my shop, I like to use conservative cut settings to avoid any potential problems. So it took the X-Carve about two and a half hours to cut this project out for me, which gave me time to clean up the shop and have some lunch. The wood I used came from two different 1x12 boards, and I thought it was interesting how one cut more cleanly than the other. The other one seemed to have a lot of stringy pieces still hanging onto the board. Now that everything is cut, I guess I've got some sanding and cleanup to do, and then I can finish this project up. Here's the finished pint glass display rack. I think it turned out looking pretty cool and I'll take you inside and we'll put it on the wall and load it up with glasses here in just a second. I really like that all the parts can be cut out on the CNC machine and it can be personalized up at the top with someone's name. Uh, also it's easy to assemble or take apart with just a few screws. If you live in an earthquake area or you have kids you might want to think about putting some uh, rods around the front to keep the glasses from falling off the shelf, but I'm not going to worry about that. So let's go inside and see what it looks like with all the glasses on. Thanks again to Inventables for sponsoring this project. If this is your first time seeing one of my videos, subscribe and click that notification bell to catch my future projects. 
As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.